What's up guys, welcome back to Frostpunk. We're uh, wrapping up this playthrough and hopefully we can pull it off. We're cutting it pretty damn close. Pretty damn close. Uh, go ahead and add some more coal storage. That's also going to be coal storage and the last one's probably going to be food storage. Just so we can reach that uh, that magical 2000 number. Okay, automaton's done. Now we're going to research uh, coal thumpers. Get cold numbers researched. And we'll go ahead and build the last two of these boys. These hardy boys. New automaton is done. That's good. It's good, it's good, it's good. Alright, the cold thumpers are done. Alright, so we're gonna turn these things around using our um, middle click and we are gonna place these two puppies Let's see if we can fit three one two no we can't fit three there probably gonna have to do it out here if we want three uh, we'll just do it right here we'll do uh, one two and three and we'll go ahead and connect them like so and then like so some reason I don't think they wanted to connect. There it goes, and there it goes. Just make sure it's connected. And then we're gonna go ahead and build our, uh, where is it? Gathering post for these guys, right here. One, and, huh. Might have screwed myself with the, uh, with the road placement. We'll just uh, delete that. Delete this road placement, delete that road placement, delete that road placement, and we'll just build it like this. And then like this. And then we will build another uh, gathering post. And it should be able to fit it right here, but I guess I can't. Maybe I can boot this one back a little bit. Gold thumper. Yeah, we'll bump it back some. And we'll get another gathering post in there. There we go. We'll get all that built. And then we'll try and put... Uh, I don't know if we'll have enough automatons. Yeah, we've got four. I think we're making one more. Oop, we need to research. Okay, I could do Steam Coal Thumper, but we're going to go ahead and do the last of the automaton integration. Damn, that took us down to basically nothing. All right, we've got our uh, food rations. But we're going to save sending that. I don't think we need to do it just yet. Um, good, but we don't have to. Because I think we need the automatons to kind of like bang out this coal. There we go. Go ahead and do that. And are we building one more or no? Yeah, we're building one more. All right. And it's almost done. Go ahead and give these guys some extra food rations. I think we only need 500 food rations, so that's going to be easy. How's our coal doing? All right, we are gaining about a thousand or so a day right now, which is okay. Uh, once we research, uh, once we research this stuff like heater efficiency and generator efficiency, that'll help a lot. That will help a whole lot. This will also help a lot too. Yeah, there we go. Now we're gaining about double thousand a day. Let's go ahead and build some more resource posts. One, two, three, four. Okay, we'll build five. Look it, we'll build five. All right, those boys are done. We're gonna go ahead and do the generator efficiency upgrade. Which is going to allow us to produce even more coal. No, you guys are de <laughs> like, 
Stop bitching about your work hours. Just deal with it. Put on your big boy pants and deal with it. Two days left. Our thing is full, but we have enough to where it'll transfer over. Uh, coal is gonna be an issue. It is gonna be damn close. It is gonna be damn close. Um, we are gonna go ahead and I'm going to delete this hothouse right here. And when I delete that, it'll free up one of our uh, one of our automatons. And I'm gonna go ahead and undo one of these guys right here, so we can go ahead and send our relief expedition. And I'm trying to see what the last one's gonna be. Six thousand coal, which we're basically at right now. The efficiency of workshops rises by twenty percent. Okay, that doesn't really help me all that much. 2000 They have no automatons available. That's rough. Come on, deconstruct this thing. Damn. In your sweet time, aren't you? Go ahead and uh, pump out two more automatons. And I'm going to go ahead and take this one off of this. This one off of this. It still doesn't free us up much. And I'm going to go ahead and take them off of here and here. I think that gives us the four we need to send them. And we're going to go ahead and send them. That's We're done with New Manchester. Good. Um, we still have the food required. I'm going to end up having to put the new automatons that come out in here. Um... Manchester's cared for, and now it's just a race of the clock. Uh, we need to get 8,000 coal in two days and 16 hours. So hopefully, hopefully, I'm going to go ahead and turn on 24-hour shifts here. Uh, emergency shift, emergency shift. I think that's all we can do. Let's see how much we can get now. It's like now we're gaining a little over 2,500 a day. Um, yeah, that's still not going to be enough. Ooh, it's going to be a close one. I don't even know if I've got time to reach Steam Hub efficiency. Might not be able to make it. We'll go ahead and research that. What do we have here? We can do it. Have faith. I have faith. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and build another gathering post. Put it right there. And I'm gonna turn off the worker at the, uh, that place. This is going to be fucking close. I'm going to slow things down. Alright, now we're gaining at least 3,000 a day. See what happens when this coal mining goes through. New automaton has been built. Um, you know what? We're going to just add another gathering post. This one is gonna be close. How much do we have here? 5,486 minus 2,100. We're gaining about 4,000 a day. That would do it. That would do it. That would do it, guys. Might have it. We're just gonna have to watch these coal piles and make sure they don't run out. They run out, we're basically screwed. 
Uh, let's open all this up to coal. Nothing else really matters at this point, honestly. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and take off these guys here and put them all in this coal. We don't need all that extra steel or anything. We're not really building anything more. Um, what else is there to do? Let's just make some more uh, coal pop up. We don't really need that. I mean, we could do the, like some sort of insulation, but we don't really need that either. Uh, the closest thing is heater efficiency, so let's go ahead and do that. Gonna be a close one. Two days exactly. Two days exactly. Right now. Actually, I'm gonna take off, uh... I'm gonna make sure these guys don't, um... Make sure they don't fuck anything up. One day, 22 hours. We are currently gaining 5,993 coal a day. So that's about, give or take, um, 3,000 a day. So I must have done my math wrong somewhere along the line, but 3,000 a day gives us another... It is going to be so very close. Um, I'm going to build another gathering post. <laughs> like, this is just getting ridiculous. I get gathering posts all over the place. And we're gonna take this off here. There we go. Alright. Come build this baby. Hopefully once this heater efficiency goes through, we'll be even better. We do have a fair amount of heaters running right now. I don't know what that noise was. Come on, come build this place. We need more coal. We're almost at one day left. There we go. Build it. You damn bastard. Build, build, build. Don't you crash on me. Alright, let's see what that is now. I don't think that did anything. It should have. But I don't think it did anything. Oh, wait, yeah, it did. Now we burn 1769. We gain a little bit more. Let's go ahead and automate that. 6,400. Um, so we're gaining about 5,000 a day. It, it is going to be extremely close. Extremely close. Um, don't think there's anything else I can do here. Actually, I'm gonna bump this down to a steam level three and overdrive it for a little bit. And I'm going to actually, let's see. Yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna do. And then I'm gonna make, I'm gonna research the overdrive coupling so it'll stay longer. But this should boost our coal uh, up by a significant amount. Yeah, it looks like we're gaining like a thousand more doing it this way. Go, baby, go! One day, 14 hours. 13 hours. Uh, I can't really extend and shift it right now because people are grumpy. People are very, very grumpy. I have faith in these guys. They can do it. I suppose if we get down to like the last hour and we're really, really close, I'll just turn off the steam hubs. Because then you'll, we'll just get like a huge boost because then we won't be burning hardly any, uh, any coal for that last hour. We're past the halfway mark, with only a day left. 
This guy's full. Go ahead and put him in here. Get us some more food going. It's gonna be a close one. It is gonna be a close one. Man, just watching this, like, I'm basically just watching the numbers with, like, holding my breath. Hoping that, hoping that it is not going to screw me and, like, barely make it at the very end. <laughs> It's, it's, it's nerve wracking. One day, five hours, four hours. Ooh. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and transfer this guy over here to cook a little bit. All right, the overdrive couplings are good to go. So that overdrive should last a little bit longer. Um, I'm not even sure what else we can really do. Um, I could upgrade the steam coal thumpers, but that doesn't really matter. It'd just be bringing out more. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do steam hub range, and then I'm going to turn off the range on all our steam hubs once it actually reaches it. What do we have? No. Deal with it. Deal with it. I swear I'm working with a bunch of nancy pansies. We're gonna make it. I guarantee you we are gonna make it. Even though I'm going to have to turn off overdrive in a little bit. But we're already crest we're cresting 7k, so we've got it. We're good. We are golden. We are in the green. In fact, I'm going to go ahead and turn off overdrive and turn that back to steam level 4. Because we've got it. It's done. 22 hours? Psh, we don't need 22 hours. We need like 5 hours. <laughs> Give or take. Let's see. 21 hours? Hopefully by 15 hours it'll be done. Shit, we'll be done next minute. The next two hours will be finished. All we have to do is hit 8k and that's it. That's game. And we've done it all. We lost zero people to cold or, or uh, we did lose one to overwork, which all you have to do is not work them 24 hours and they won't die of overwork. And that's it guys. Hard mode, the arcs, done. Not too shabby. But like I said, building up our food supply, like early on, made that that last bit, made that possible. Um, without that, we would have been screwed. If we'd had to build a bunch of stuff and then start gathering food, we would have been screwed. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and let the final cutscene play through. Watch it or watch it or not if you don't want to. But uh, thanks for watching. This was the Arcs story mode on hard mode. Kind of a how-to, how to beat it. Uh, like I said, it is. It it definitely goes to the last few minutes. Um, it is a very very difficult uh, playthrough, um, and it requires a lot of micro managing. Um, some things I'm sure I could have done better if I'd have paid more attention. But all in all, we beat it. So, good game. Thanks for watching, you guys. Come back and watch more. I'll do the refugees next. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Later. Later.